Hello and what's up everybody, it's your girl and it's Tabi and once again I'm back with another exciting video. So guys today I'm going to share with you my evening routine right from the time I take my lunch till the time I retire to bed. So guys, immediately after taking my lunch, I take a nap which is never granted due to the schedule of work here. So guys, after taking the nap, Usually, I wash the utensils and I start with the cups, then the plates, then the spoons and the flask and I finish up with the sufurias. That's my order. Usually, I use um, a piece of alkagunia. It cleans so well and I use my liquid soap. So, I fill the sink with water and have a basin where I I had some water for instance after rinsing I place my utensils at the trolley so that they can drain off the water so guys on this day I had to prepare some millet for preparing unga ya kupika uji. So the mtama tunachanganya na maindi kidogo. So for now I have to crush the mtama so that I can remove the black heads from the mtama. Mtatumia kinu na mchi kukrash until the blackheads open up so let's see if we are going to make it so guys we are now done so i'm going to use my hotel ntaziweka mtamazangu hapo Alafu nitapepeta. Kwa hivu, sasa hivu tujaribu kupepeta. Tuwane kama the blackheads are going to separate from the real mtama. It's so calm. Hakuna upepo. Bada kushindo ku separate so well. My mom has to help. And she's doing it so perfectly. You can see it's already getting clean. Wow. It's now looking good. So you can see the results. It's looking so good. So guys, let's head direct to the cow's house where we are going to clean the um, feeding area. Failure to which? Failure to clean cleaning the feeding area. Alafu, you had some feeds. To the existing ones, the cow will actually refuse to eat. So you have to clean it so well and remove the old food. So whatever you are going to remove, you are going to throw it at the part which is not concrete. It's going to mix up with the kinyesi angombe, the cow dung, and it's going to be used as manure so guys we are going to clean up the cows shed we clean it so well you can see some dust it's because it has taken around three days to be cleaned usually we clean every two to three days in a week and it's so good to ensure that your cows are clean so that you can have healthy cows. Mm. 
when it's wet you use the, the spade to remove the cow dung but for this case it's dry so clean now so i can head to the next one and clean it too so guys now i have to go and fetch some firewood kuni natafuta kuni kiasi kuni ambazo zinatosha kupika sapa na kupika breakfast kutarisha breakfast sina panga so i'm going to use my hands to break the firewood and use my knee I have to collect until it's enough for preparing supper and breakfast. So now our food is enough. So I'm going to carry them on my head since I don't I don't have a a rope to tie them and carry on my back. So let me take the food home. So now I head to the shamba and get some drinks for supper. Then I come bring the cow to the house so it can feed as it waits for the milking time. So here I come to do the milking, carrying my warm water, the milking oil, and the milking jar. So I have to clean my hands so well and make myself comfortable with the milking seat, the milking stool. I wash my hands and the teats of the cow. Apply some milking jelly. You apply the milking jelly to ensure that the teats are soft. So I drain off any remaining water from the milking bucket and the milking jar and I start with the milking. You milk until there is no more milk coming from the teats or the udders. So I'm now done, I go to the kitchen and take the measurements so that the milk can be taken to the dairy shop. We are going to use our funnel and our sieve to sieve the milk. Pour the milk into the um, bottle. So now I have to prepare the skuma wiki. I have to chop them ready for supper. Then I'm going to take a shower. Then I come and prepare our supper. So, guys, let me know what's different that you do during your evening that is so different from mine so guys let's meet in my next video and don't forget to subscribe like and share with your friends goodbye